So my beautiful people, I am back with another Dying Light 2 video and today I'm going to showcase to you how you get something pretty special, something pretty important. Basically a charm known as the Corrupt Charm which gives you 500 durability on your weapons. Basically infinite durability on your weapons people. Well that's what it will feel like anyway. Today I'll explain all. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like it really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more Dying Light, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so to get this firstly, well we need to go back to the developer room. I've been, I've, I've been there so many times guys. It's unreal. Now to make this easy on yourselves, you need to have completed the broadcast story quest mission. Because once you've done that, you get a lift which brings you straight up here. If you haven't done that, you're going to have to make your way up. Um, I can't remember when you get the grapple hook. You can definitely get up here if you got the grapple hook. I posted a video on this a couple days back. I'll try and link that within the video description if I remember. Um, I've seen one person on YouTube get up here without the grapple hook. But either way, you need to get back on top of the VNC broadcast building. And once you're up here, people, you need to go across to that building right there. So, you know, just do your usual jump, bring out that paraglider and just glide across. And just hold back to make sure you don't like, you know, miss it. Because if you do, that would be pretty awkward and embarrassing and quite funny at the same time. Now also guys, if you want to join my Dying Light 2 Discord community, my Discord is linked below. Uh, come there, find people to play with, talk about the game, secrets and whatnot. You know, if you've got something to show me, um, you can DM me there too. Link below, I'll uh, pin it at the top of the comment section too. Okay, so once you land here, we need to put these cables. You've probably seen this before to get to the developer room, but if you haven't, this is what you got to do. So you got to pin that in there and then we've got to drop down. We've got to go to a, a floor, a couple of, uh, a couple of floors down. Now this can be quite tricky. Um, and you got to remember because we're going to use our parachute here. Press, press your parachute button. Don't hold your parachute button because pressing it releases your parachute, holding it releases the cable and then we've lost the cable. So yeah, okay, so just literally just step off. Actually, no, it could probably just step off backwards. It'd probably make it easier. So step off backwards and then deploy your parachute. That would mean then you don't have to do a, like a, like a, a 180 because we're going to obviously go out, but we need to come back on ourselves. So if we step backwards, we, we eliminate that. I don't know why I didn't think about this first time. Okay, so we may as well just stand here. Okay, so let's just... Stand on the edge because I low key didn't just try this and fail and cut the video, but you guys wouldn't see that. <laughs> so step backwards. Actually, no, we're going to look that way. Step backwards, deploy the parachute. And there we go. Why didn't it work like that, just? <laughs> Why didn't it work like that, just? Okay, so when we're here, we have to plug this in. Where is the. Uh... Wait, what, 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 what? Hold on a bit. Hold up, hold up a minute. You know what it is? I've already plugged it in here, so I'm guessing it's not here for me. But in here, guys, there's going to be uh, somewhere you plug it in. You know what? It's actually easier for to show you the old the footage I did. Uh, I posted on my video earlier. Okay, so yeah. But either way, guys, you'll plug it into a, a finger here, which you're seeing on screen now. And then you want to grab the other one and do the exact same thing, people. But like I said, you probably want to step backwards. Because uh, otherwise, you're going to find it a little difficult to do.
Okay guys, so you will eventually get down to here as you just witnessed me on screen. Now, now, if it's your first time coming here guys, remember there's going to be a big old dirty fat dude who's going to try and blow himself up all over you. So be wary of him. But once you actually get into the dev room, it's pretty straightforward. What you got to do is, you have to sit on all four of these chairs. Well, say, okay, so you sit there, you sit there. No, so you sit here, you sit there, you sit there, and you sit there. Once you do all of that, the charm will spawn right there. Okay, so we sit here. We get back up. Don't have to wait around or anything like that, people. Then you just park your ass here, just like so. Then get back up. And then park your ass over more, just like so. Get back up. I love the way it says campfire. <laughs> <laughs> There's a campfire in the middle of their apartment. And uh, then you just park your ass here. Just like so. And then just wait. And then you're seeing it spawn right in front of your eyes. Give it a few seconds, guys. It, it will appear eventually. It will appear. Let it come. Let it come. It's coming. It's coming. There we go. So you see that right there? So we can leave the campfire here. Well, leave the, <laughs> the chair. And then we can pick it up. Crack. It's a blueprint for a charm. Okay, so before we look at that, um, if you haven't been here already, there's this dev letter here, which is pretty cool. Uh, there's a few other bits and bobs. I do definitely... Um, recommend you exploring this if you want the the finger gun uh this ring here which is i'll shoot it once it's your what's it called again i can't even remember the left finger glover okay so you just shoot out your hand like that it's pretty badass not gonna lie you just sit on the bed right there for about a minute all these teddies will spawn around you and it will spawn right there okay so this charm that we have to craft which is somewhere here. I'm not sure where it is here. Did I actually? It says it's a craftable item. But is it a craftable item? I can't. Uh, I can't see. No, my bad. I'm an absolute idiot. It is three o'clock in the morning here, people. Excuse me. Excuse me. So we see, we've got this weapon here, so we can modify it. Charm, and then we have it right there. Apply plus five hundred durability. Plus 500 durability. So this weapon here, it, it lasts quite a while anyway. I mean, the artifact weapons last ages anyway. So 210 base. What's my other one? Uh, my others are 210 base. I think they're all 210 base. I don't know. Not yet. 210 base durability. Simply put this bad boy on. Switch out that and get an extra 500 an extra 500 it basically is infinite weapon durability infinite weapon durability and i just put it on a weapon a and it got equipped that's how tired i am that's how tired i am i've got it equipped no i haven't there it is right there but there we have it guys the beast so we go down and slay some zombies with it people so we can see how it works let's go Let's get out of this room. I've been here too many times. I hate it. I hate it. <laughs> okay, so. Oh, shit. There we go. No, miss that. Miss that. Miss that. Miss that. Now, I'm probably going to die here because it's the middle of the night. I'm going to have screams and all sorts of shit. I don't even know why I'm even demonstrating this to you. What am I doing? Okay, so let's jump down. Come on, motherfuckers. I mean, look at the bar. It's not even moving. I'm gonna get my stamina back. Uh, chase, chase started. Who are you gonna try and chase? I'll set your ass on fire. Okay. 
Boom, motherfuckers! Oh, shit. I forgot how hard it is when you're getting chased. But you can see, guys, the Jew is absolutely ridiculous. I'm just going to stand here chopping. My stamina is up. Oh, yeah. I'd stand here on that chopping, motherfuckers. But yes, guys, I'm going to run now. <laughs> I really don't want to die. You know what I mean? But yes, people. There we have it. That's how you get the Corvette Charm, which gives you 500 extra durability. And guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did leave a like, it really helps me out. If you're new around here and want to see more Dying Light, be sure to subscribe. And remember my beautiful people. Join my Discord. Find people to play with, talk about the game, secrets, absolutely everything. Guys, thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.